A YouGov poll conducted last month found Camilla to be the 10th most popular member of the royal family. Of the 1667 adults surveyed, 36% liked the Duchess of Cornwall while 29% disliked her. Though the Duchess has not always been as loved as other members of the firm, in the past 18 months Camilla has become an increasingly central figure in the royal family. During last year's lockdown, the Duchess offered comfort and laughs by participating in a number of royal engagements. Camilla even led the national tributes on VE Day while she posted many video messages online to shine a spotlight on her royal patronages. A royal expert claimed the Duchess could become a secret weapon for the royal family once her husband, Charles, succeeds the Queen as monarch. Speaking last year on Podcast Royals, Angela Mollard suggested that Camilla's wealth of experience will help her offer the Prince of Wales the required stability and security for him to rule as king. She said, someone like Camilla who has a sense of humor, who is a dry wit. She can see the absurdity of royal life in some cases and yet still has enormous respect for the charities she represents and a genuine interest in them. I think she's a magic weapon for the royal family and when Charles eventually does take the throne, we will see the full wealth of experience, security and stability she brings to Charles in that role. The royal expert also stated that the Duchess of Cornwall helped Prince Charles cope with the alleged difficult stage in Prince William and Prince Harry relationship. There has reportedly been tension in the brothers' relationship since the Duke and Duchess of Sussex made the unprecedented decision to step down from their senior royal duties last year. Ms. Mollard said, If this fundamental relationship with Camilla is a healthy and supportive one, whatever she is called, that's going to have a tremendous bearing on his role as king. And, in fact, in his ability to parent William and Harry through this difficult stage. It can't be easy for Charles seeing his two sons at loggerheads, well, not necessarily at loggerheads, but distant from each other. Camilla and Charles married in a civil ceremony at Windsor Guildhall in April 2005. She styled herself as the Duchess of Cornwall, after her husband's peerage rather than using the title of Princess of Wales. The decision was initially made to quell public sadness surrounding Princess Diana's death. Last year a Clarence House spokesperson reiterated that when Charles is king, Camilla's title will become Princess Consort. The spokesperson said, The intention is for the Duchess to be known as Princess Consort when the Prince accedes to the throne. This was announced at the time of the marriage and there has been absolutely no change at all. Related articles Diana and Freddie Mercury acted like naughty school children Queen's private secretary on Jubilee. You must not kill, monarch Boris Johnson warned tax hike could choke coronavirus recovery.